I'm meteorologist Peter Chan at the National Weather Service for Alaska statewide weather on this Wednesday, December 21st, 2022. It is the day of the winter solstice and we continue to watch very strong Arctic high pressure centered over the Yukon Territory with a central pressure above 1060 millibars. This has produced some bitterly cold temperatures, especially throughout the eastern interior. This morning, the low in chicken was 58 below zero, but that's four degrees warmer than yesterday morning when they were 62 below. And temperatures will slightly modify in those areas, uh, but still very cold air is expected to persist across the interior. In fact, we'll have a shot of colder air working its way west southwestward all the way to the Yukon Delta as we go through the, uh, oh, just prior to Christmas. But the main weather story is going to be a couple of different weather systems. First things first, we still have a flood warning in effect for the eastern Aleutians. Dutch Harbor uh, on Alaska area have experienced over six inches of rainfall with another two to three inches expected this afternoon through midday Thursday. And uh, there have been reports of some minor flooding along with some debris flows. So as a result, the flood warning there will continue. And then uh, we have a blizzard warning that's been issued for the far eastern Arctic coast around Kaptovik. We expect strong winds and some light snowfall to create blizzard conditions overnight and into Thursday morning. Also, a continuation of winter weather advisories and wind chill advisories for the central interior that include Bettles, Tanana, and areas uh, just to the south of Fairbanks. Fairbanks itself continues to have an air quality alert through uh, Thursday early afternoon. And newly added, uh, we have uh, winter weather advisories for strong winds and blowing snow for the Copper River as well as the Matanuska River basins extending westward all the way through Palmer as strong east-northeast winds will be developing on Friday in response to a tightening pressure gradient between that big Arctic high in the Yukon and a frontal system and a series of low pressure systems that I'll be lifting out of the North Pacific and extending all the way back across the Eastern Aleutians. More importantly, there is a uh, major winter storm that'll impact the Panhandle here prior to Christmas. Uh, winter storm warnings are in effect for much of the Panhandle starting uh, late Thursday night and early Friday, continuing into Saturday. A number of locations will see well over a foot of snow with heavy snowfall. For Alaska Statewide Weather, I'm Peter Chan.